Hello fellow drivers, this is Sebastian with Spin Driving School. Today we are going to take a look at um, buses, essentially how to pass them or go around them, though technically you should never be going around a bus, or in most situations at least. Um, you can safely go past the bus uh, under certain circumstances, um, however they do have those yield signs in the back and there's the law, so you should preferably be stopping behind buses in most cases just give yourself lots of space because at the end of the day um, you know with large vehicles they are always going to win so give them space and some buses bus drivers rather um, are not always as courteous as they should be uh, which we'll explore that in the video so let's take a look and go through it one by one So we'll go through uh, various uh, situations here. Um, hopefully you'll get a better understanding when it's okay, when is it okay to, uh, when isn't it okay to go around the bus. Uh, so in this video here, you can see the bus um, going through the intersection. We have a green light. Uh, we're going through, he's gonna pull over to the right. Um, they do have that little, you can call it a getaway lane or a little area where they pull over. And we're just passing by. We're not going around the bus. We'll, we'll, we're staying within our lane. I'm um, not going over the yellow line. And we're just safely going past the bus. Here in this case, I'm about to make a right turn. Now, if I was going straight, no problem. But in this case, I'm making the right turn. And there's actually two buses there. So this bus is um, obviously sticking out a little bit further. So I'm going to slowly turn. You know, sometimes you, you can get stuck in this situation as well but the bus keeps on moving, so I'm just staying behind him. Obviously, he's going over the yellow line uh, in this case because there's really not a lot of space on this road. Uh, and here we go now. He's going to be pulling over in a second over to uh, another bus stop, and I'm going to be passing him. Um, now, we'll go over a couple of things there. Also, there's going to be a vehicle coming up on the left-hand side uh, that is at the stop sign. So that car there, the white car has a stop sign. I'm not going to worry about him, but it's possible. Sometimes when you stop for a bus, they can uh, pull out. Also, oncoming traffic is great. I'm going past the bus. I'm not really going around him. I'm just kissing the yellow line. No problems. Um, as long as the bus is obviously not moving, um, then you can always safely pass him if you have enough space. And obviously, make sure that you check for oncoming traffic. Um, if there's oncoming traffic do not drive on the other side of the road just to go around the bus always stop and wait in this case the bus has its hazards on so i'm going through this yellow light lots of space i'm just space i'm just going around him or pass him whatever you want to call it but i'm not actually going around the bus i'm just safely passing him i'm staying within my lane or our lane um in this case same scenario now this one's going to be pretty tight but there's still enough space there so just gonna just gonna go past the bus i'm staying within my lane i'm making sure that i'm not going over the other side i'm not impeding the oncoming traffic um now in this case we're in the right lane uh the bus is just about to pull over underneath the sky train so we're just going to stop and wait uh if you get yourself in that situation on the test just stop and wait if they ask you to go around you can go around but um, a lot of times the buses move at the same time as you're going around them and they actually in, in this scenario they can actually very often go into the other lane depending on which bus it is so that's a recipe for disaster you're going to get squished between the curb and the bus he's he's going to win every time so just wait um and you know if he puts his hazards on or something then you can go around him at the same time at the end of the day the bus is always going to move um you know wait five ten seconds maybe then think about it but there's always the option um there we go we on our way you can make a lane change you don't have to stay behind the bus that's fine there's there's always a lot of ways um to go around it you can always make a left or right turn if you don't want to be stuck behind the bus but <clears throat> and you know if the bus wants to move over like what's going to happen here give them lots of space again just let them in they're going to win every time um this is also a very um 
maybe not a common scenario, but it happens. Um, you make a right turn, boom, there's a bus right there. Again, he's got his hazards on, so he's probably gonna be there for a while. Now in this case, for sure, if you wanna go around him, do it, but um, you know, make sure that you respect the left lane, you know, shoulder check, make sure that it's clear and safe. Also from that intersection, technically, if you want to, you can just make a wider turn and just go into the left lane immediately as long as no one else is occupying that lane or turning into that lane at the same time. So at the end of the day, safety is your number one priority. Um, other than that, respect the buses. So we're going downhill. Uh, there's not a lot of space here, so we're gonna pull over and stop. Um, just chilling. No problems. There's really not a lot of space to go around him um, or past him. Um, just going to hang out. He's signaling. There's a cyclist. Uh, the cyclist definitely should have yielded. Um, you know, whatever. We'll make a video about cyclists another day. Just stay behind the bus. 30 kilometer zone. Double yellow line. You should never be passing that under any circumstances regardless. So just we'll get there ladies and gentlemen just be patient again pulling over to a bus stop nowhere to go obviously bus on the other side double yellow line we're not going anywhere under these circumstances i've seen a lot of people in these cases you know just in the rush trying to get somewhere um, unless it's an emergency even then that's it's a recipe for disaster um, so you know just be patient and wait. There's uh, there's there's nothing wrong with that. Um, we'll just get into this next video coming up here. This next video here, I believe, is the last one. Um, so now we're just about to get a green light. Uh, there's a bus right there at the bus stop, uh, and he is uh, about to merge back into the lane or into traffic. He had a signal on. Just gonna give him lots of space and. There we go. Now he's actually going, going to be pulling over uh, in just a few seconds without a signal. Now he is going to be braking, which obviously that still gives you some information, but some bus drivers, you know, don't signal at all. I've been in those situations where they don't signal either left or right, or, um, or they just sometimes do really ridiculous things. But again, with any large vehicles, just give them space and distance. That is always going to be your best friend. Your best case scenario is give them, give them room because they are going to win every single time. So as we are proceeding here, you'll see uh, in just few seconds, he is going to be moving over to the right side, to the right side for a bus stop and no signal. So, and this isn't me driving, by the way, this is uh, one of my students, so uh, bear that in mind, but at the end of the day, you know, it doesn't matter. Um, so there you go, no signal, he pulls over there. We're just going to slow down, give him a little bit of room, and then... And it, all I'm saying in this situation, if he had signaled, it would just give me more time to prepare. This is why signaling is so important, because um, it gives the other drivers information of, you know, what's about to happen. So um, there was a lot of space for me to pass him there, so no problem. So. So yeah, that's it. Uh, hopefully uh, that was a helpful video and gives you some arsenal to work with. And yeah, respect the buses, respect the large vehicles. Stay safe, practice.